Welcome back to another Reddit video. We're gonna have a lot to talk about this week, so let's just jump right into it. Holy s, he's back. Dude, that pop, the roof blew off of that place. Dude, The Rock came back for SmackDown. Oh my God. To see him actually come out, man, that is surreal. John Cena in The Rock interacting. That episode of SmackDown was an all timer. Let me see what you guys are saying. My mind exploded and I started to hit the gritty. <laughs> I love that. Now the question is, is The Rock sticking around for a second or did he just want to do a little appearance, you know, get the fans a little hype. You know what I'm saying? The Rock was talking about how uh, The Rock and Roman Reigns was locked in for WrestleMania 39, but plans didn't really go through. You know, he teased a little bit of WrestleMania 40. WrestleMania in Philadelphia. The Rock can't be teasing this kind of stuff, man. You can't just say this sh and not follow up. I'm saying that that's a potential too. So oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. See, see, here's the thing, right? Here's the thing. I may be, I may be overthinking this, right? But ever since Triple H has been booking the show anytime someone goes on like a podcast or something like that and start like teasing just a little bit that's usually what happens right pat mcafee had adam cole on his show right then they have a match impulsive with seth rollins and logan paul seth rollins talking about oh i got back problems ah ah my back ah my back right and then he start feuding with shinsuke and then shinsuke start targeting the back the rock going on pat mcafee i don't know he may do something at wrestlemania 40. i don't know i hope so nope. <laughs> name this tag team la knight and john cena uh hustle loyalty and yeah <laughs> Personally, I wouldn't allow that level of disrespect. Took Becky Lynch long enough, less time than it's taking you to main event WrestleMania. Damn, Becky. I don't care if this is kayfabe or not, that stings a little. <laughs> Me when someone says wrestling is fake. Go ahead and tell you. Shut your bitch ass up. <laughs> I would like to thank The Rock for a new meme. <laughs> <laughs> Cause you know people are gonna overuse that for at least a month. What was John Cena looking at? Wrong answers only. Your mom. Brandon, I know you're subbing. Is this Mandy Rose? Cause best believe I've been getting tagged on Instagram, Twitter. This is what it is, isn't it? It sure is. We're moving on. I'm not subbing to that sh Listen to Stone Cold, everybody. When you get in that goddamn shower, hit the bar of soap and rub it all underneath your armpits and your balls and your fucking asshole. What do you smell? <laughs> Facts, though. Facts. Here's a tube of toothpaste. Pour some of this out on a little toothbrush in you. Scrub them fucking gimmicks in your in your mouth and call <laughs> teeth. Scrub them gimmicks. <laughs> I have never been happier to wear a Stone Cold shirt right now. Last but not least, your old trusty hairbrush. This thing does a now what the hell you breathsin? <laughs> Goddamn wonders if you got some hair. I ain't got no hair. <laughs> I ain't got no hair. <laughs> Oh, I love you, Stone Cold. Thank you for that laugh. That's getting an upvote. <laughs> so, um, who thinks of this sh <laughs> Who thinks of stuff like this? Buddy got caught in 4K. Yeah, come on, dog. That That's just desperate. <laughs> this man zoomed in just to get a shot of her ass. That's crazy, bro. Look at all the legends Austin Theory has encountered. He's met The Rock, went face to face with John Cena, got a stunner from Stone Cold. Brock Lesnar absolutely embarrassed him. Austin Theory is really getting the rub, bro. Honestly, I think his promo with The Rock was probably some of his best work yet, like uh, talking on the mic. That was like the most natural Austin Theory has like really sounded. And I think from now on, is gonna. I think Austin Theory is going to seem a little more natural on the mic. That's just my guess. It should have been me. Damn. That looked like it hurt, but it also looked like he's okay with it. <laughs> he's not moving a muscle, bro. Before we continue with the Reddit, I wanted you guys to know that I am officially an affiliate with WWE Shop. So that means whenever you buy something from WWE Shop, you can now use my link. So if you're about to buy a shirt like this, or a replica title, or even a Slammy, you can use my link down in the description below. The link does support me and all the proceeds will go right back into the channel. Now let's get back into the Reddit. Finish the sentence. Jade Cargill will debut on Raw. Yeah, yeah, I'm saying Raw. If Jade goes to WWE, I need to see Jade versus Bianca. I need to see it. Jade versus Charlotte. Jade versus Rhea. Jade versus Asuka. The, the possibilities, I need to see it. LA Knight in high school? What is this? Let me talk to you. 
Yeah. 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 Oh. Yeah. 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 This is terrifying. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I have to finish the story. Shut up. I'm talking. <laughs> you blew it. Dummy. Yeah. You choked. Dummy. Yeah. yeah. I what is happening on the WWE side of TikTok? Yeah! 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 This is terrifying. Where did where did Jay come from? Yeah! Yeah! Let's go! Yeah! Like, like, let's go, baby! Yeah! <laughs> hey, love to see it. Upvote. Rich return got a bigger pop. John Cena or The Rock? I mean, do not get me wrong. John Cena's pop was loud. Probably the loudest that year, but nah. This is the biggest pop, I think, in recent memory for WWE Returns, at least. <laughs> the roof blew off of this place. The Rock definitely had a bigger pop. I was there. You lucky son of a gun. I'm shaking. <laughs> I'm fucking shaking. So real, bro. You're that close to The Rock, I'd be shaking too, man. Imagine being there that close too. That kid right here, The Rock just made his day. Got to meet Kane at Sam's Club. Kane looks like he would shop at Sam's Club, honestly. That's sick, bro. Was he nice? Yeah, he was. He gave his autographs and followed us on Facebook. On Facebook? <laughs> what? That's crazy. My friend told me to RKO him at graduation. Not at graduation. Yo, he sold that pretty well. Oh, someone slid in. One, two. Hey, why were you trying to break it up, man? This is graduation. Let us be happy, all right? <laughs> Please make Samantha Irvin the ring announcer for 2K24. Facts. Oh, that Bray Wyatt tattoo is so clean. Upload. He actually hit it. Bro, The Rock is looking cool. Jacked. You know what I'm saying? This man is huge. And why are they all wearing the same thing? I really want to know that. <laughs> he did hit the fuck out that people's elbow, though. Cena will be on the show. Pat McAfee returns. The Rock shows up. Banger episode of SmackDown. All timer episode of SmackDown. Best part of the payback pay per view. I'm gonna fight all these urges, my brother. <laughs> you horny son of a bitch. Nia Jax returned from my POV. Damn, how long was she waiting there? They spoiled the return? She didn't even run in for real? Raquel got dropped. <laughs> my question is, I don't even really mean any disrespect by this question, but who asked for Nia Jax to return? I'm actually curious. Like, if you're a Nia Jax fan, please let your boy know. <laughs> We got a lot of names in this tag team. We got Bobby Lashley and we got Shawn Michaels. The almighty showstoppers. <laughs> That's all I got. I was going to say the almighty showstoppers. What a guy. What a guy. Bald and beautiful. <laughs> I love that one. John Cena just killed Carmelo Hayes. Is he about to? Oh my God. Damn. Bro, how come these physics never happen to me? I want to try that. How many times have you been injured? Brian Danielson. Yes. Down. Don't disrespect my boy like that. Brennan, you have to see this. All right, well, if I got to see it, let's check it out then. Oh, oh, he got height on that. Oh, my God. Whoa, my guys are cooking right now. Oh, OK, they snapping. Let's go. That's definitely getting enough vote. You'll have to see it. No way. Is that you? Homeboy, you, you, I'm not going to lie to you. You're you're like a year and a half late. <laughs> Brennan predicted the future. <laughs> Who ended up being more successful in this video? That was two years ago. I really don't remember. Between Jimmy and Jay, Jimmy was the more successful brother. If you, I was not expecting that. That's crazy. Will Jimmy be the more successful Uso? I guess we'll find out in a couple months. Who was the best WWE champion of 2021? Drew McIntyre, Bobby Lashley, or Big E? Probably Bobby Lashley, right? Yeah, you know, no, I'm going to say Bobby Lashley. I was just watching old Reddit videos and then I found this. Game over, bitch. See, Mandy's was good too. Don't you start. Are you serious? Come on. That time Alistair Black and Ricochet got pulled over on Ride Along? Wait, what? I actually did not know this. No way. Wait, actually? What you guys do? What kind of... We work for WWE. WWE, huh? Yes, sir. Yeah. So did you jump off the top ropes and stuff? Uh, yeah. <laughs> 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 this man like Ricochet is suffering in the car. He's like, cop, please leave so I can get to my hotel room and lay the f down. Come on, you put some ice on there, Nancy. Dude, Nancy? No, that's me. crazy. Oh, yeah. The disrespect to my boy Ricochet is crazy. Thank you, yes, thank you so much. We're outlaws. 
<laughs> I did not know that, actually. What the hell? Your new dog, Max, looks like he's about to bite you. <laughs> A selfie with Cena? My dad and Vince McMahon's love for Shane. Aww. Damn. Funny WWE moments? What the hell is that <laughs> Paul, you know you're not doing any damage to that man. <laughs> you f***ed up. Stunner! Yeah! <laughs> I've never seen them miss the table completely before. They jumped way over it, didn't they? What? Nah, that was Suk being like, uh-uh, no cool stuff happening here. <laughs> Going on almost six months since WrestleMania, one title defense. A bit humorous while also touting how long he's been the world champion. I think we are low-key getting to a point where like Roman is just not having a ton of defenses anymore. But also to defend Roman, he's beaten almost everyone. <laughs> WWE could do a little bit better with building up new stars. The only people we got left for like challenges for Roman is like AJ Styles, Jay Uso, Solo, Cody, possibly The Rock. There's just not that many people left, truthfully. And like whenever Roman does show up, I'm locked in. So I don't think it matters that much, but I would like to see a little bit more title defenses. One title defense in six months is a little crazy. Not gonna lie. The Rock got bars. Hold on. He's spitting. Honestly, listen, kid, I could go on and on. I can explain every natural phenomenon. The tide, the grass, the ground. Oh, that was Maui just messing around. Look, where I've been to make everything happen. Look at the me mini mini just tick it to Okay, Rock! Let's go, Rock! Let's go, Rock! He spin! Let him cook! Vince looks like he went from being a CEO to being an old bad guy on a Spanish Telenova. Damn. <laughs> when will the documentary of his life come out? Uh hopefully never. This move is fire. See, that move is fire, but I also feel like it's a little long. Something about the pump handle, right? But it feels like it takes a long time just to get to the slam. Like, there's a lot of downtime for someone to just be able to get out of that. But I don't know. How else would you get him up for that? I don't know. Nonetheless, it's a great finish. POV, eight-year-old me in my bedroom pretending to be in the WWE. Nah, did anybody else used to have a pillow that they would just whoop ass on? Like... Mm, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> that was me. I had like a long pillow from like a couch or something. I would whoop that thing's ass. RKO's, attitude adjustments, you name it. Who's the most hated here? John Cena? Shawn Michaels? I don't think anything stopped with Shawn Michaels. Roman Reigns after he beat The Undertaker? Or Dom? No, I don't think anything's beating Shawn Michaels dissing Brett <laughs> in Canada. I don't think anything's beating that. Dominic Mysterio getting wasted by Jey Uso, GTA style. <laughs> Wasted. Me and my tag partner were shook. I gotta see it now. Claymore and Spear? Oh, Spear and Spear! That, no, that was fire. That was clean. I would have been losing my goddamn mind. Oh, and they got eliminated? That's tough. All right, yeah, I'm giving that enough vote. Are Seth and Becky the first Grand Slam couple? Maybe, actually. I I, I don't know, but that's a great question. <laughs> Trey and Red from 2K20. <laughs> what in the world just happened? Springboard, where are you going? Did they just get eliminated? <laughs> what the hell? All right, guys, that's going to do it for the Reddit this week. If you want to watch any more Reddit videos, you can watch right there. I'll see y'all next time. Deuces, ooses. <laughs>